dear students very good morning and welcome to the lecture series for the course on ec402 nano electronics of 8th semester electronics and communication engineering students of kerala technological university today we are going to discuss about the nano electromechanical systems of module 6 of nano electronics course in this topic we will discuss what is nems what are the features of nano electromechanical systems a typical nems operation will also be discussed here and what are the potential applications of nano electromechanical systems nano electromechanical systems are nanoscope devices that have a characteristic length of less than 100 nanometer and a combined electrical and mechanical components actually nems is the logical miniaturization of micro electromechanical systems that is nems nems typically integrate transistors like in nano electronics with mechanical actuators pumps or motors and can be acted as physical biological and chemical sensors the nano electromechanical systems class of device includes nano machines novel sensors and a variety of new devices that function on the nano scale nems can be fabricated either by top down or bottom up process we have seen the case of nano layer fabrications there are top down approach and bottom up approach the same kind of approaches can be used in the fabrication of nems devices also top down methods using lithographic chemical vapor deposition or mbe metal molecular beam epitaxy methods can be used which are mostly used for the purpose of fabricating nems but in bottom up approaches involve the fabrication of nano scale devices by self assembly or self organized structure using atomic and molecular building blocks the materials for the fabrication of nems structures is not limited to silicon material we have seen the case of microelectronic structure silicon or silicon dioxides are the main uh, materials used but in the case of nems devices three to five compounds such as gallium arsenide are very considered to be the nems material the basic mechanical element of a nano electromechanical system is a nano site suspended film a membrane or a beam as an active component and the easy structural deformations of such mechanical elements provide high mechanical responses for the nems the electronic devices to which the beam is coupled are of comparable dimensions so the mechanical element of the nems are usually suspended films or a membrane or a beam and that can be considered as the active component to produce some kind of displacement like or distance measurement of such type of measurements the materials for these active components that is components used for or components used this mechanical element in the system and this materials are either silicon or silicon carbide or carbon nanotube gold platinum etc the small mass and size of nems give them unique attributes that enables the new applications and fundamental measurements for the system because of the very smaller size of nems 
it can be used for different kinds of applications including the fundamental measurements and here this is a schematic representation of a three terminal electromechanical device nanomechanical device can measure extremely small displacements and weak forces at molecular scale with modern surface and nano machining techniques nano electromechanical system can be built with masses approaching a few attograms attogram means one attogram is equal to 10 raised to minus 18 grams such a very small mass of uh, mass is there for the nems devices and the device will have a cross section of about 10 nanometer and let us consider the case of this schematic diagram see in this schematic diagram we have an input transducer to which an electrical input signal is given and the transducer will give out a mechanical stimuli to this mechanical system and an electrical control signal will be given to a control transducer through which a displacement perturbation can be done or displacement or even a source of force perturbation can be given to this mechanical system so that mechanical system will produce a mechanical response as the output and that mechanical response will be given to the output transducer in order to produce the corresponding electrical output signal so this uh, three terminal electromechanical system will operate like this so that the input electrical stimuli give a mechanical response in the form of a displacement or a force and that will be measured by the output transducer in the form of an electrical output signal that is the basic operation of an electromechanical system an electromechanical device can be thought of as a two or three or generally multi terminal transducer that provide input stimuli that is signal forces and reads out a mechanical response that is output displacement that we have seen here here this is the input signal here this is a three terminal device one one terminal is going for the input signal another is for the control perturbation signal for the control transducer and the third one is for the output signal here so at additional control terminals electrical signals can be applied as control signals and that will be converted by the control transducers into varying forces to perturb the properties of the mechanical element in a controlled and useful manner the input output and control terminals have been shown in that particular schematic diagram now we will consider what are the application of nems the potential application of nems are in diverse range of fields from nano electronics to medicine and biotechnology one of the main constraints in the wide scale application of nems is considered to be in their packaging what happens for the packaging limitations because the each device nems that is nems each nems device will have a unique requirement for interacting and protection from the environment so it is difficult to standardize the packaging procedure for nano electromechanical systems that is the limitation because we cannot standardize the packaging procedure for this electromechanical system because the interaction and environment protection for different environment will, different environment will be different so that is why a standardized packaging procedure is not possible it's not it is not really difficult for nano electromechanical systems a key application of nano electromechanical system is the atomic force microscope tips we have already seen that the atomic force microscope has got a cantilever beam at the end of that beam there is a tip and that tip is usually manufactured that is fabricated with the help of nano electromechanical systems 
nano electromechanical systems can measure extremely very small distances forces and displacements these extremely small measurements find its application in the fields of biological pharma and engineering nano electromechanical system uh, system can be used as a mechanically controllable quantum point contacts and nano machines consume heating this energy nano electromechanical systems can be used as accelerometers which are used in airbag deployment system in automobiles using nems very accurate and cheap nano gyroscope can be fabricated to find the direction in airplanes and ships nano gyroscopes and nano robots were emerged very recently nano electromechanical systems can be used in inkjet printers as nano nozzles which direct the ink to print nano electromechanical systems can be used in smartphones which can be used as a mechanically assisted transportation of single electrons in transportation of single electrons we have seen how this transportation of single electrons is possible that is possible with the help of its nems nems based mri has been developed recently bio nems bio chips are developed for sensing chemical force and nems can be used as a thermal actuator so now we have seen what are the basic features of nano electromechanical systems what is the basic function of a nano electromechanical system and some of the potential application of the nano electromechanical systems with this we conclude this session here thank you